right, Dirk Pickers here from SD Compound. Just wanted to let you guys know what I've been up to for the last uh, couple days to a week. Uh, I've been working on a paint job for one of the crew, and uh, we had some uh, family and friends crew out uh, for camping at the compound for a few days. So I took a few days off from Facebook and uh, social media just to hang out and do some stuff. I didn't even pick up a camera the whole time, so uh, I didn't do pictures or anything. It was a really nice break from... Uh, everything I'm doing pretty much every day. Uh, so I'm gonna show you guys what I did with this body here. It's uh, for one of our local crew member, uh, Daryl Isnard, for his Max, Traxxas Max truck. And uh, he needed a new one because, well, his old one, let me see here, dig through my pocket. His old one was uh, laying all over the track in pieces. I just took my dog for a walk and, well, this is what it was. I found a couple of pieces like this out on the track so uh, I know the last pictures I saw of Daryl's truck it was pretty much missing uh, sides of the box and fenders and the tailgate and it was ripped right apart so I'll show you what I got here for him. All right here is the body uh, like I say I just recently painted it and I haven't even unmasked it I took off the front of the masking on this front edge here I removed some of that so I could install the included grill and headlight stickers but I laid it back down I wanted to do this on video so everyone could see it when I see it and in the back same thing I peeled it up and installed the tail lights and you can see there one of our catchphrases at SD do it in the dirt because of course we started out all of this riding motorcycles dirt bikes and uh, RCing in the dirt and now we're pretty much everywhere uh, street dirt you name it, bikes uh, soon we're gonna probably be branching out into BMX section uh, of SD so as you can see I did a bunch of writing on there before I was gonna be doing castle stickers on here or uh, graphics but we changed our minds on that uh, so you can see I mark what I want to paint green and the orange section it's jiffy on the outside of the protective coat so I lay it out before I uh, paint. It's gonna look great. Sorry I'm taking so long. One-handed here. I could set the uh, camera up on a tripod, but I figure I'd just hold it and get in here. Yeah, it's gonna be beautiful. This neon orange this is all Tamiya paint. They call it uh, polycarbonate bodies. The uh, neon orange here is an amazing color. I laid down some clear pearl before I sprayed the orange. The green, I didn't add pearl to it before I sprayed it because it was already a metallic. The white sections there, I just left white, no pearl on those. I thought it would be a nice contrast when the sun hits it. The orange will have, uh, you know, like sparkle pearl and the white will just be a flat white. Same with the uh, skull on the top with the Canadian leaf there, the maple leaf, sorry. That's a metallic green, like I say, all Tamiya paints, and just plain white. I know I'm taking my time on this video, but uh, I really did, uh, I tried to do a good job for Daryl. Daryl's one of my good buddies that comes out here to the compound, and we have a great time bashing. Unfortunately, the only problem with this is I know this poor body is going to get beat right up. Daryl is uh, not afraid to use his RCs to their fullest, which is excellent for us here at the compound to get video and to watch because Daryl puts on definitely a good show when he comes out here and rallies with us and I'm definitely looking forward to seeing this on his truck his truck is uh, orange with green uh, aluminum that's what he chooses for his colors so it's gonna go just amazing with this I'm gonna just step into the sunlight I think I've got all the mask off there I'm just gonna step into the sunlight and uh, we'll have a look at what it looks like in the sun it's probably gonna be so bright yeah you can see you can see that sparkle there and the color is not even close to probably what I'm seeing in through the camera it almost looks like it's bright yellow that might change when I get it on the computer or when it's on YouTube but it's uh, it's gonna be amazing Daryl looks great I'm really happy to have uh, pulled this off like I wanted to and uh, yeah I can't wait to see it on your truck man so 
thanks everybody for watching don't forget to uh like subscribe and uh hit that bell so you don't miss any of the action here screaming demons rc sdrc we are out Shit, I take it.